What if I told you there was a backup point guard that leads all guards in shooting percentage around the rim, and at one point this season was shooting as high as 85% around the rim? When we hear Dennis Schroeder's name now, we immediately think of his contract situation. But today we're going to study how he is so effective at finishing around the rim. We are going to look at the different components that go into his ability to finish around the rim. The two main things to look at when he drives is his combination of physicality and finesse. He may not be known to be one of the strongest players in the league, but look at how he uses his body in this clip to knock the defender off their path and create a space to get the layup off, dropping it in with a nice soft touch. In these next few clips, he takes a less physical approach at the rim and decides to finish quick off the glass before the shot blocker has time to react. There's plenty of information out there on one foot finishes, and Schroeder is special because he can finish off either foot with either hand on either side of the rim. While he mainly uses his right hand, there are plenty of examples of him using his left to quickly get the shot off. It all depends on the situation. Another thing to note is that he can do a quick finish both underhand and overhand. Both are needed depending on the angle you attack the rim from, and there's no specific rule to this either. A lot of this is instinct, and you kind of just adjust on the fly, feeling out what you need at that moment. He can also take some bumps in the air and stay on path to finish. Here he actually curves a bit inwards as he drives, and now when he does get bumped, he's still at a good angle to finish. We will cover more on driving angles later, but notice how he's very intentional about where he ends up around the rim depending on what spot he attacks from. It is also valuable to study his change of speed move as he can basically blow by a defender whenever he wants, and no matter what speed he is going, he can still maintain control of his body and finish effectively in a variety of ways. He will occasionally drive hard one way and finish with the inside hand because it is quicker. It is not always necessary, but again, you are reacting to what you feel on the court, and this can be developed over time through playing. We talked a bit about his touch when finishing, but plays like this are prime examples of how skilled he is. While he's not on Kyrie's level of finishing, look at how he got this layup to drop. He jumped off one foot, glided almost sideways, and puts the ball in the top corner of the glass, away from the shot blocker where it drops in. The touch you have on the basketball is a big component of being a great finisher. Same applies in this next clip where he initially holds off the defender and then hits a tough underhand floater. This may look like a routine shot, but there's a lot of skill involved in getting it just over the shot blocker and perfectly dropping it. The shot does not have a lot of room for error and it just shows how important having a soft touch is. As we've seen before, and as you'll see in the next few clips, Schroeder also likes to bump defenders while he's still on the ground, taking them off their path and creating enough room for himself to quickly get his layup off. This is a key for shorter guards, and you can tell how comfortable this is for him, as he always stays in control of the finish after the initial bump. In this last clip, we're going to look at an example of how Schroeder can contort his body in a way that is necessary to effectively finish at the angle he is at. Here he takes a bit wider angle and if you observe his body when he's finishing, his chest is actually facing the opposite sideline. This not only helps him get a better angle to quickly finish off one foot, but to extend the ball away from his defender. This is a skill that can be trained and used at different points of the game. That's going to be it for today. If you feel you learned something from this video, please leave a like. We're trying to build a community and the support goes a long way. Subscribe if you are new and look out for plenty more content in the new year.